Back on the island and we're gonna do an update. We just had the glass uh, supply here yesterday and they've given us, they've taken the measurements. We're going to be fixing up that whole brick on top. And uh, we just got in our, we're about 60% in the project, but we just got in these foam sheets, which we have to put in the bedrooms to protect from uh, noise. So it's like a rock wall. So it's over there in that room. And we've just got it in. Uh, we're doing double wall so that when the sun hits the one wall, the heat dissipates through the middle channel and goes to the uh, goes up or dissipates and it doesn't come in so that keeps the room uh, temperature cooler inside so all of this is double walled wherever there are orange bricks it's because uh, it's the bathroom or a wet area and there you need to have orange bricks so it doesn't absorb as much but uh, yeah we're closing that up and up there, those are two bedrooms. We're splitting up the bedrooms and putting a coffee area outside in case somebody doesn't want to rent the whole floor with the kitchen, living room, and dining, and two bedrooms. So it's a two bedroom villa, but if in case somebody doesn't want to rent the whole thing, they can rent the rooms and there will be an, a refrigerator and uh, um, you know, a coffee maker or something there where they can enjoy the space here. And, uh, yeah, yesterday we went and checked out the bamboo fence. It's coming up. It's it's taken, so it'll take some time, maybe a year or so, and it just, like, starts going nuts, and it'll be nice. Good protection. So, yeah, so the rock wool is here. This is my latest. Today is the 20th of February. I was traveling for three months. And in the three months, all this came up. So, and all the updates were in Thai, so I didn't post them, but uh, I might do that. But there's the rock wool. And let me go through the property. There's the living room. We're putting glass here. And there's going to be lights being... Actually, I'm not going to... I'm not going to uh, spoil the surprise. Uh, but this is the living area. Even right here, we're not sure what we're going to be doing. We're thinking of putting uh, glass so you can put a seating area and having fish underneath. Or it could be a jacuzzi. Or it could be an ice bath, but uh, we'll figure that out as we go along. And that's Lynn. Huh? This is the um, uh, the washroom, you know, with a washing machine and dryer. It'll be open, locked out from the kitchen, locked out from the living room. This is the smaller bedroom, which is not as small, but uh, yeah. And that's the rock wall, which we're going to be putting in between the walls. So double layer walls with the rock wall in between to keep out the noise. Uh, as a, So it'll be quiet. So this is the one bedroom. Then, this is where we're going to have, outside the bedroom, we're going to have a coffee area, like a refrigerator and a coffee place so in, like I said if they don't want to rent the whole villa they can rent one bedroom there are four bedrooms here which can be rented out per whatever uh, on uh, Airbnb or uh, uh, on uh, Agoda or whatever but uh, that's where the refrigerator coffee machine you know uh, hot water flask will be here and then this is the master bedroom uh, which is Kitarang Met Nani. It's about 25 square meters about. And uh, we're closing it up because there are houses up there. We were going to put glass here in the beginning, but bedrooms should be private and uh, you should be able to sleep without any disturbance. That's why we're going for the double glaze glass screens here so that there's good protection. Because on the island, uh, ไม่ต้องเกาะใส่ก่อนดูว่ามันเป็นยังไงจากข้างหน้า
So we're doing the same thing here. We're putting um, a coffee area for this room so that they have their own private uh, refrigerator and everything. And uh, yeah, like I said, they can rent out that one room. That's a concept that we came up with um, in case they don't want to rent the whole villa. And then, oh, this is the rock wall going up all the way. And it's supposed to protect, like I said. Yeah, we can. Oh, it's itchy. They're saying don't, don't touch it. But this is the rock wall sheet, you see, over the bricks. And then there'll be another layer of bricks coming in. And that would protect the noise from each room and uh, give uh, the bedrooms total quiet. Because on the island, you have people who play drum and bass or techno and their, their beats or their bass is not controlled. They don't know how to control it. So just to, for that reason, we are doing this. Uh, so you, when you come and sleep, you can sleep properly and uh, get a good night's rest. Uh, and uh, that was one reason I did that was because I've stayed on the island and not, nobody's doing that. So, you know, there's a party and it goes on until 2, 3 in the morning. You just, I'm a very light sleeper and it affects me, so... I went with uh, blocking the noise. Kuncha Saikang now, we are thinking of building a section just like there where uh, you put the refrigerator and also we're just testing out whether we should do it from the inside or outside. Uh, because this is a great area to have seating. You can get up in the morning, make your coffee right here, come and sit here and look at the view. Uh, it's around 2 p.m. now, so we have quite, it's not that hot, but. There is the sun. Uh, it, so it goes from that side all the way and sets over there, west. So you get good um, evening sun. Uh, and it's not that hot right now, even though the sun's above us. Chen Song, but not a lawn to me. Second floor might be hot. Yeah, down here is not that hot. So uh, by 3, 3 o'clock, uh, the sun's already there. So there's a lot of foliage here, a lot of uh, protection from the sun. So it's, it's hot for maybe about 2, 3 hours in the whole day. And uh, then it cools down. So good uh, placement that we've chosen. And uh, yeah, when I have the next update, I will post it. Enjoy.